Hey, how's it going? It's Michael here with a brand new Cloverfield topic video. Typically when talking about the Cloverfield movie, the biggest topic of discussion is of course the monster Clover that wrecks havoc on Manhattan. As seen in the movie, however, it's not the only monster present during the attack on New York City. During the middle of the movie, Clover sends out smaller creatures from its body to attack the humans. For this video, we'll be talking about what is the Cloverfield parasite. So let's get into it. The small creatures in Cloverfield are a parasite and are the secondary monsters that come directly from Clover. The name for them according to the Department of Defense is HSP, which stands for Human Scale Parasite. It's an undersea life form that has been dormant for thousands of years, attached to the monster Clover from Clover Field. There were nearly 2,000 parasites on Clover in the movie. The HSPs in size and weight are close to that of a large dog. With regards to its physical appearance, it has extremely sharp pincers. It has 10 legs and is double jointed just like Clover with six spider-esque limbs. In addition, the parasites have four pincers on the back and top of its body. The parasites are also equipped with a toxin and when it comes in contact with humans via scratches or bites, it results in the victim expanding to the point where they explode. According to the Department of Defense's research from the movie, after analyzing the properties of the dead HSP, it stated that each one has a yellow substance which turned out to be a form of saliva that may be the toxin. The parasites are fairly strategic as seen in Cloverfield with them moving in unison and in coordination with one another. They tend to go in tight enclosed areas to catch their prey. For example, we see a parasite attack the main group in the dark in a narrow train line in Cloverfield. The creatures are also quite stealthy and have good detection skills and are able to locate future victims from great distances. The bite of a parasite is deadly due to a key ingredient in their blood called seabed's nectar. This is believed to be the factor that with a mixture of unknown properties and the saliva causes the victim to ultimately blow up. The lifespan of an individual who's been bitten by the small creature is fairly short, ranging from 20 to 40 minutes. And lastly, as seen in the movie, upon being bitten, a few symptoms arise from the wounds. These include things such as lightheadedness, bleeding from the eyes, vomiting, pale skin, and more. Anyway, that wraps it up for this video. What do you think of it? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. As always, if you you enjoyed this video then be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the hybrid network if you haven't already i'm michael for the hybrid network i'll see you next time take care